Sometimes we're doing data analysis. We have the need for technique called transformations. Why do we need such a thing? Sometimes we experience non-normal data or um, non-linear data. Uh, we also may find outliers that are actually real data points that we need to find someone to include with the rest of the group. And maybe another option is if we've done DOE, regression, ANOVA type uh, calculations uh, where we need to do residual analysis. Residual issues can also sometimes be resolved through the use of transformations. How do we do this? Uh, what it is is a technique to convert your data in, basically into another access system. This could be by taking a uh, square root uh, value of the original raw data, a natural log, an inverse, uh, something a little bit more complex but useful called a logit transformation. And there's others, there's other distribution shapes and, and, uh, and so on, but those that I listed are kind of the core. Uh, so it's basically creating a new column of data and analyzing that new column, assuming that after that uh, conversion, that the data then behaves in a normal way or uh, eliminates the outlier residual issues that you were experiencing. However, a big key to it is to justify uh, the use of the particular one that you choose. Uh, we don't want to just solve math games. We want to have some physics uh, behind us if we can, uh, some understanding of the system and why that transformation makes sense. For instance, a square root transformation uh, is very useful and very well documented to be useful for what they call count data. Uh, so if you have that type of data, that would be a good basis for that well-supported one. Depending upon the transformation or the tool or the background you have, it depends upon the level of justification that you can provide. Clearly, the stronger the justification, the more accepted your results and analysis and decisions will be. So if you need, um, a, if you're doing data analysis, if you do enough of it, uh, you get, I'm certain you'll run into opportunities uh, to need a transformation or where they can be beneficial to you. Uh, the main thing is to understand why you may need them, a little bit about how you use them, uh, and depending upon the tool, uh, how that integrates into your particular software it can be easy or complicated, but then bottom line, make sure and justify that use uh, so that you're making good decisions and ones that other people will support and follow. If you need help creating your own transformation or doing data analysis, it'd be lovely to help you here at Perry Solutions. Give us a call or send us an email and we'll help you out.